Today we're going to unbox the TP-Link Outdoor AP um, to be installed in the uh, backyard. We had done the wiring to the backyard using aerial cable on another video. And this video we're going to be looking at what's inside the box of the EAP and the installation. So inside this box, uh, this EAP uh, AC1200 comes with a power line adapter, um, two antennas, um, the AP itself very slim and thin, which is uh, hardly visible, um, the screws, and the nuts and the wall plugs uh, to make the installation easy. Um, in our case, we're not going to use the um, power line adapters. Uh, because we are directly uh, running a wire from our power line switch uh, that's the wall mounting bracket uh, which fits perfectly and it's easy to remove from the ap once it's mounted so now what we're going to do is mount uh, the eap uh, access point uh, on the wall this is the inside where the waterproof uh, jacket is. So the next step is we're going to put on the two antennas. It's a screw on. So it's pretty easy to put these antennas on two of them. You can adjust the positioning later. Uh, but once they're on, we are ready to place them and mark the holes for the uh, mounting so uh, when you place them i would suggest put them in a place where there is uh, no rain coming down in the side um, once that is done we want to uh, screw the bracket in and uh, once that is screwed in, it's just two simple holes, two simple small Phillips screws. Mm -hmm. And uh, that can screw in right into that wooden shed. And um, once that is done, we are good to mount the antenna uh, onto the uh, mounting bracket. So the next step is the wire has been run inside the shed. So we want to make a hole and feed the uh, CAT6 wire through that hole from inside the shed to the outside so that we can now uh, plug in that wire into our excess AP into the uh, uh, TP-Link outdoor access point uh, put that in and then close it up so that water doesn't get in mount it onto the mounting uh, bracket that we had screwed in earlier so at this point um, everything is done uh, clean up the wire a bit so that it's uh, hidden behind the AP and uh, we are good to go in and now uh, configure the AP adopt it into our ecosystem of access points please uh, subscribe to our channel if you haven't yet done it uh, and uh, please put on any questions that you have and we will be glad to answer all those questions